Hi everyone, use Newton Raisin method to solve this non-linear equation. Correct to four decimal place, start with the initial value of x equals to 0 0.5. So first of all, we have to get to the function with the given non-linear equation 3x plus cos x minus 3 equals to 0. So once it is equals to 0, we can make it to a function. So your function will be 3x plus cos x minus 3. In newton raisin method, what we need here is a function and is differential function. So differentiate 3x, we get 3. Differentiate cos, we get negative sign. And differentiate 3, we get 0. So when we have fx and f5x, we can start our newton raisin method. With the initial value, x known is 0 0.5. So the first approximation or the first iteration, it will be using 0 0.5 substitute into the function and differential function. Then we can use our calculator here. So bear in mind, when you're doing trigo, you have to set your calculator into radian. So choose your radian mode. Then only we start key in the formula of newton raisin method x minus the function up here will be 3 alpha x plus cos alpha x minus 3. And denominator will be 3 minus sine alpha x. Then we press calculate. Put in our first initial value 0 0.5. Then we take down our result 7.4. So what you need here is four decimal place at last. So we will at once our working by two decimal. So seven four six nine. Then at once two three four. Three four after four is seven. So we round off become three five. Then we doing second iteration by substitute the value that we have here into the formula again. So here will be in substitute into the function and substitute into the differential function so of course you want to write it in full also can we will encourage you to write it in full if or not you want to write it in term of function also accepted then we press calculate then plug in the value that we want to calculate and equal so 0 0.7578 at once 2, 8, 9, 1, so 8, 9. Then for the third iteration, we just repeat the procedure until we get a repeated x. So calculate. Again. So we notice here it already repeat. Then we have to stop. And come up with the conclusion the root for this nonlinear equation is x equals to 0 0.7579 which is correct to 4 decimal place.